This video shows how the DEMGP brain sensor is operated with the connection of the headlight with LED. As you can see, this is a main water uh, sensor connected to 12 volt power supply here. Then there is a rain sensor wires coming to the sensor plate that is mounted on a headlight surface here. And then we have the relay output going to the headlight power supply. So let's take a look what's going to happen if you have the water touching the headlight. So here we have a alcohol actually, not a water. And let's try to hit it. Oops. Now the light went on. And while the water is touching the sensor plate, you're going to see the LED headlight being lighted on. Now let's try to wipe out the source of light, I mean source of water. And once water is removed, the headlight was turned off. Let's try again. Water, trying to hit the right place. Hit enough water on the sensor plate, the light goes on. Same principle can be applied to different scenarios, like closing the roof down in case of the water, uh, rain, or stopping your washing machine if there is a water leak. Additionally, to the water sensor plate, there is a button. Where is the button? Where is the button? On uh, here is the button. On the sensor board. If we press it, the light will turn on for 20 seconds and then turn off. So you can use it as extra functionality to, let's say, turn on the lights when you live in the car or just use the relay for 20 seconds. Basically, it's add-on functionality to our ring sensor. And as you see, the 20 seconds went on and the light is off.